Best skills to pick up in college, part four, unconventional thinking. In colleges, there's a lot of talk about critical thinking or about how you, the student, learn how to critically evaluate sources, documents, or data, which basically means that you don't take everything you read or view at face value, and you possess the tools to challenge arguments or conclusions. And that's nice, and maybe I'll talk about that later. But an even better skill to develop is unconventional, creative, or outside-the-box thinking. Um... If you grew up in America, this is not an easy task because American culture, and especially American white culture, demands a high level of conformity to rules and social expectations and assumes that violating them is rude or inconsiderate. Uh, this is so ingrained into our culture that it is hard to break free from. Um, the skill of unconventional thinking means that you develop the understanding of which rules you can ignore or violate without getting into too much trouble. A little bit of trouble, by the way, is totally fine. Um, and therefore, you start thinking outside of conventional wisdom when faced with problems that others have looked at repeatedly and could not solve. That is, if 30 other people had the same solution to the same problem and it got them nowhere, proposing the same solution the 31st time is probably not going to get you uh, anywhere either. Um, and so you really need a fresh approach. It means that you stop saying, oh, but we can't do that, or oh, our rules and laws don't permit us to do that. No, you have to dump all of this mindset. There are lots of study areas and courses where you can start picking up that skill, start developing an unconventional mindset. Usually these would not be your standard professional majors. That's why you need to get out of the conventional thinking about college majors and minors and start thinking about diversifying what you study. And more on that soon.